What is happening, family? A and J balance, balanced family. How you guys living? So yo, um, a while back, like a couple months ago, you guys told me to react to this Joyner Lucas, um, Ross Cappuccioni, um, you know, the video track, whatever, like that. And uh, you know, what I'm saying, you guys, I think someone requested it again recently. You know what I'm saying? So let's just get straight to it, man. Something I should have did a while back. We here. Let's get to it, right? Wait, what does that say? Was he was did you see Joyner? Was that him in the in the in the in the class sitting down? Or is someone that looked just like him? But yo, y'all know that feeling, new kid in the class. It could it could go both ways, you know what I'm saying? It could either be a good, it could be cool, or you know what I'm saying, it can't it, sometimes it's not the best, but it is what it is. Hey, there he goes. Should I, should I trust this kid? Now, y'all tell me, if you the new kid in school and you see Jordan Lucas, he's like, yo, what's up, bro? Like, yo, let's be cool, blah, blah, blah. You gonna trust him or not? Let me know if you gonna trust Joyner or not. If you gonna be like, nah, this dude looks sketchy right here. Or if you gonna be like, you know what? Yeah, he look cool. I'm gonna talk to him. Like so far in the video, it just looks like it's too good to be true. You know what I'm saying? He like, yo, I don't worry, I got you. But did you notice when it said, "Don't worry, I got you"? Like, don't even stress it. You heard the voice, like the voice in the background was like a dark voice. It was like, don't, don't stress it. I got you. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know, man. I think Lucas is on some. He's on something, man. Oh, let's continue. Approach me and try to pay for me. I I'm not dead, all this 
blood that I'm losing it. I heard my car drive off, and I looked up and seen the sun, and that was all that I saw. And I heard my conscience tell me, get up, nigga, get up. You're losing blood, oh my. Don't fall asleep or you'll die. Stay awake and move as much as possible. There's no time. Find some help and try to yell. You ain't too well, oh God. Wake up, nigga. Wake up. Wake up, nigga. Now, I know he's gonna, it's gonna come full circle as to why, why this is happening, but why is this happening? Like, what the hell? What? What? This is crazy. Woke up and said, but my day was worse than I prayed for. Now, how did he survive all these, all these, all these hits with the shoddy, though? That's another thing. I think he said he hit him in the arm and all that, but he hit him like twice with the shoddy. Like, I don't know. Head out and down the stairs from the eighth floor. New kid in class, he sat alone taking notes while my niggas were making jokes at the clothes that his mama paid for. Had no family, but was cool with the local gangsters, tattoos, and some off roll of probation for breaking rules. The lake was all I knew. All I wanted to do was cruel, smoke weed and say fuck school. Wanted guidance because all my role models I would look up to was a okay. giant and a young dude. Okay, so it just switched sides. Now he's on Joiner's, from Joiner's perspective, I guess, right? Search to the past and said, fuck you, now violent. And this gang had always looked out for me, vibes for me, and adopted me. Said they wanted to rap with me, and I wanted to get down. Guess there was something missing, anything comes with a price. There's only one condition, all you gotta do for initiation is kill an innocent victim and leave them there with no witnesses or no snitches. If you do that, you're down with the clip. And that's for life, so don't you ever think of getting out of this shit? I thought about it. Soaking up the vibe as I study for information, trying to choose my victim, plotting a weakest prey. But today on my way to eat lunch, I approached him and told him we should be cool if only I got to know him. Cause on the side of town, he would need some protection. It's crazy, reckless, and phony, unless he's some sort of gangster. He only safe with the police. He said his name was Victim. I dapped him up at the buses. Was kind of skeptical about me at first, cause he didn't trust me. But the more he got to know me, he couldn't tell what my motives were. Hoping that I was sincere, but little did he know I was trying to snake him. people calling me yo i was in yo this shit just had me hypnotized hello hi how did it go it was good we already got back home what do you mean we're already home they they said they would call her back on wednesday oh yeah they said you know you know it's either texas or california that she's gonna fly to if she gets the place if she gets it No, it's not. Anyways, yeah, we're home. All right. All right, bye. Oh, man, I was so into that just now. I was so into that just now. Let's freaking go. The panic, I told him, relax. Then I pulled the keys out the ignition and hopped out and laughed. Seen his light flash in an instant. I inched to his driver's door. Then he tried to lock it. He couldn't. I ripped him right out of his seat and then grabbed his side of my jeans and then put out the shot. He had cocked it twice till he screamed. Bang. Shot his arm into pieces. I'm watching his blood leaking and another oh. shot to his chest. Seen his stomach squeezing his breath and his lungs collapsing. He's down on his fucking knees asking me why. He looked at me. I looked him dead in the eyes and I smashed his face with the barrel. Knocked all his teeth to the sky. And then shh. Sound of the shot, he cocked back. I pressed the heart against his head and blew his fucking top back. Fucking car. Fuck. How you throw the shotgun on the floor? calling and then 
and talking on the phone like that. This is crazy, bro. Talk too much over the phone, meet me at the spot. Facts, don't even talk on the phone like that. I won. What? Oh, I thought he like survived. I thought he survived, but then I realized that he turned into into the other perspective. But that was crazy. Yeah, man, that's real shit, though. You know what I'm saying? That's that's gang shit. But you know what I'm saying? That's ooh, that was that was. I like that video a lot, man. I'm glad y'all told me to react to that because honestly, I heard of that and I never had any interest in listening to it. And I know that Joyner like makes such great videos. You know what I'm saying? Whether it's the I'm Not Racist or it's the Frozen one, which I really I did enjoy that one too. Um, but yeah, he makes really good videos, great songs, you know what I'm saying? Like, he's not just, like, rapper, rapper, and can't make a song. Like, that's a great song, but he don't get no recognition for whatever reason, you know what I'm saying? But that was definitely cool. Let me know your opinions on that, you know what I'm saying? Like the video, share it, follow the Instagram, you know what I'm saying? All that good stuff, man. A&J Balance, stay balanced, peace.